Hey guys, I wasn't sure whether to do this video, but I thought maybe it may be useful to some people. So, um, I'm currently doing a personal training course, if you didn't know. And we learn, or I learned something completely new. So you might see, this usually happens a lot of the time with like online trainers. They will give out diet plans, which they're not supposed to. So as a personal trainer, you're not supposed to be giving out diet plans. Um, you can give out a, f a very vague nutritional advice. So on the verge of like what's good carbohydrates, what's good fat, stuff like that. And then following obviously that outdated um, pie thing, you know, how much carbohydrates, how much fats and stuff like that. So you're only supposed to give up off basic guidelines you're not supposed to give out like tell people what they should like like you know like diet plans like you know that sort of thing we're not supposed to because apparently that hits a nutritional level nutritional nutri nu nutritionist and that's how you say it, nutritionists um job which you have to go for uni for that for four years the simple reason is because everyone has like obviously different you know your body reacts to different foods like some people can eat this some people can do that can not eat that and the problem with giving nutritional advice in depth is that you may have a client who may react to something differently like for example it turns out that they are um, I don't know, they have an intolerance to gluten or something like that. Okay, they might have not told you before because it might, you know, they might not have known it, but obviously stuff like that, that can happen. It's mostly just to cover your back, uh, especially if you are working, say, if you're working for a gym. Or even then, even if you work on your own, if it's somebody that has money, they could probably take it further so be wary of um, personal trainers that do give out you know nutritional plans and stuff like that um as i said you can give out guidelines so you can't particularly say for example oh you must do this or you do that you can sort of say well i've heard this it may work for you or something like that you can word it out like that but you can't say oh do this you need to do this you need to do that when it comes to nutrition because you're hitting a very thin wire which personally most people didn't know and you wouldn't know outside but then when you look in you could be any level of a person you could be a level four personal trainer you still you still can't hit nutrition you cannot give out diet plans as i said it's more of it it can be a little bit of a struggle um, because they kind of go in hand in hand when it comes to nutrition and physical activity um, as I said you can even you can give advice so you can say okay to somebody you can say oh write down what you eat and you can say oh you're eating too much of that or you're eating too much of that you can go for that but you can't you know this, you can only touch basics you can't physically write them or tell them what they need to eat as in like food wise you can only give them like guidelines for them to have follow and hope they follow without you full on you know writing a diet plan so i thought that may be interesting to some people so yeah that's it for this video so bye guys